Well, hey friends, how are you guys doing today? I'm sorry, Davi was very, very needy today. So he was barking and my husband was home, so he was getting annoyed. So I had to bring him in here. <laughs> um, anyway, uh, the Lord, so this is how it works for me, guys. You know, if anyone's wondering why I get messages all the time. Um, so I'm just sitting there, you know, reading comments, not doing anything. And all of a sudden my spirit changes. And then it's almost like, a shaking either in my hand or in my foot um, and then I hear my child write this down so then I get out my notepad and this is how it happens guys and I claim that Jesus Christ is the son of God he's God he uh, was born of a virgin he died on the cross blood is sh shed his blood for us he rose on the third day okay this is um, ignore the telegram and the whatsapp people because they're trying to scam you um, Dobby's blind, so he's 17, so that's why his eyes look like that, but he's my baby. April 16, 2023, Revelation 4, 6. Before the throne, there was a sea of glass like crystal, and in the midst of the throne and around the throne were four living creatures full of eyes in front and in back. Revelation 7, 3, saying, Do not harm the earth, the sea, or the trees, till we have sealed the servants of our God on their foreheads. Ephesians 2, 7, that in the ages to come, he might show the exceeding riches of his grace and his kindness towards us in Christ Jesus. Jonah 1, 4 through 9, but the Lord sent out a great wind on the sea, and there was a mighty tempest on the sea, so that the ship was about to be broken up. Then the mariners were afraid, and every man cried out to his God and threw the cargo that was in the ship into the sea to lighten the load. Shh, you're okay. But Jonah had gone down into the lowest parts of the ship, had laid down, lain down, and was fast and was fast asleep. So the captain came to him and said to him, What do you mean, sleeper? Arise, call on your God. Perhaps your God will consider us, so that we may not perish. And they said to one another, Come, let us last caught. La <laughs> let us cast lots that we may know for whose cause this trouble has come upon us. So they cast lots and the lot fell on Jonah. Then they said to him, is they said to him, please tell us for whose cause is this trouble upon us? What is your occupation and where do you come from? What is your country and of what people are you? So he said to them, I am a Hebrew and I fear the Lord, the God of heaven who made the sea and the dry land. Malachi 3, 4. Then the offering of Judah in Jerusalem will be pleasant to the Lord as in the days of old as in former years. Jeremiah 1, 7. But the Lord said to me, Do not say I am a youth, for you shall go to all to whom I send you, and whatever I command you, you shall speak. Okay, and here's the message, guys. Dummy, you're going to have to chill. Seven, my child, seven, it's coming. Mega earthquakes, tsunamis, trumpets. I am at the door. Wake up, heed these warnings. Philadelphia is the key of David and my open door. You have to have my key to enter through my door. Do you believe in me? Do you trust in me? Are you walking in my spirit? You must be born again to enter my kingdom. I am your living water. You are saved by your faith in me and by my grace. Why are you trying to work to get to heaven? What did I die for? Your righteous acts can't save you. Only I can save you. Your wicked hearts are condemning you. Your words are condemning you. Why are you twisting my words? Why aren't you asking the Holy Spirit for confirmation? Why aren't you praying to me for discernment? Heaven's gates are wide open to my true believers, the ones who love me. Their hearts seek me. They don't doubt my forgiveness. They don't doubt me. They know I died for them on the cross. They know I shed my blood for them. They know I'm coming back for them. They love me and they love their neighbor. Oh, children, why can't you see I'm keeping you from my wrath if you let me? I gave you free will, but now is the time to choose. You can't love me and love this world. You okay, Dabs? You okay? Pack it up. A true follower of me will be hated by this world. They hated and persecuted me also. You question my existence. You wait for a Messiah, a false Messiah. You can't see I'm the lamb that was sacrificed for your sins. Why are you burning incense and worshiping statues? You practice witchcraft and sorcery and you bow down to false gods. I am your God. I am your Messiah. These are contractions and they are almost done. The baby will be delivered soon and I am catching you up. The dragon will try to devour the rest of you and make you worship him. He will try and take your soul. There's only two things I won't forgive, and that is rejecting me with blaspheming the Holy Spirit and worshiping the beast by taking his mark. 
By taking the mark, you will have to worship Lucifer and you will no longer be my child. Everything I created will be covered up with the mark of Lucifer. I don't want this for any of my children. Fire and brimstone is what you will receive when you don't have me. All the words I have spoken will come to pass. Stop mocking my prophets. Stop mocking my dreamers and visionaries. When my children share a message of my coming, stop scoffing. I am coming. I delay so you will have a chance for repentance and come to me. But my delay is coming to an end. My warnings are final. Lincoln, Nebraska, seven times quake, destruction. Meteorites falling. Detroit, fire, fire. They will need lots of water, but it will be contaminated, forcing you out of your homes. After Harpazo, eminent domain will come. Riots, protests, no money, layoffs, major companies take down small ones, a domino effect, they will all fall, only the major ones will be left, they will be a part of the Luciferian agenda, collateral, you will have nothing to bargain with, the enemy will own it all. 2 Timothy 4 8. Finally, there is laid up for me the crown of righteousness, which is the Lord, the righteous judge, will give to me on that day, and not to me only, but also to all who have loved his appearing. 1 Thessalonians 3 7. Therefore, brethren, in all our affliction and distress, we were comforted concerning you by your faith. Colossians 2 7. Rooted and built up in him and established in the faith as you have been taught, abounding in it with thanksgiving. 1 Peter 1 5. Who are kept by the power of God through the faith for salvation, ready to be revealed in the last time. Revelation 7 8. Of the tribe of Zebulon, 12,000 were sealed. Of the tribe of Joseph, 12,000 were sealed. Of the tribe of Benjamin, 12,000 were sealed. Esther 4 9. So Hathak returned and told Esther the words of Mordecai. Joel 1 9. The grain offering and the drink offering have been cut off from the house of the Lord. The priests mourn who minister to the Lord. Here's another message 666. Lucifer, angel, darkness, thaws. Oh, I'm sorry, 666. Lucifer, angel. Darkness falls. The beast has risen. The angels come out of the abyss. Locusts come out of the abyss. Geomagnetic storms. The lightning strikes will show my hour. The ninth hour clock stops. Moon upside down. Virgo at her feet. The constellation turns. No more lights. Can you see the signs of my coming yet? Keep looking. Redemption draws nigh. Your redeemer, your rescuer, your friend, your Lord God has spoken. 2 Thessalonians 3, 5. Now may the Lord direct your hearts into the love of God and into the patience of Christ. Mark 1, 11. Then a voice came from heaven. You are my beloved son in whom I am well pleased. Habakkuk 2, 7. Will not your creditors rise up suddenly? Will they not awaken who oppress you? And you will become their booty. Jeremiah 1, 5. Before I formed you in the womb, I knew you. Before you were born, I sanctified you. I ordained you a prophet to the nations. John 5, 8. Jesus said to him, rise, take up your bed and walk. Revelation 19.20, then the beast was captured and with him the false prophet who worked signs in his presence by which he deceived those who received the mark of the beast and those who worshipped his image. These two were cast alive into the lake fire with brimstone. Matthew 15.9, and in vain they worshipped me, teaching as, as doctrines the commandments of men. Joel 2.4, their appearance is like the appearance of horses and like swift steeds, so they run. Okay, guys, if you don't know Jesus, ask him to come into your life. Repent from your sins. You know, it's a change of mind. Uh, believe in him with all your heart and he will save you guys. He mentioned faith so much in that video. He's tired of people talking about, you know, you have to do this. You have to do that. No, you have to trust in Jesus. Okay. You have to trust in him. Um, and, you know, just a reminder, he's talking to the Jews, the believers, the unbelievers. So there's certain words that go to believers certain words that go to jews certain words that go to unbelievers so you have to kind of follow along because every message is like that god is brilliant um and he's awesome i think my dog needs to go outside um but anyway you guys have a blessed day and i will speak to you later